this is pretty much my go-to Monday outfit. So if I was literally like going to placement, I'd probably wear um, literally this exact outfit. So it's Monday, you've got a lecture, you need to be comfortable, you've not really done the prep over the weekend, so you really need to pay attention. So on a Saturday, if I was going out with my friends, flatmates, or if I was just going out, I'd probably wear something like this. Tip of my tongue. Hi guys, so a bit of a different video today. I thought I'd show you guys some different outfits that I would normally wear during like a normal week at uni. So I've gotten together like my lecture outfits, going out with friends outfits, so seven different outfits all together. Um, hopefully this gives you some inspiration on what you can wear to uni if you're going to uni in September or like soon. And um, so yeah, I really hope you enjoy. So it's Monday, you've got a lecture, you need to be comfortable, you've not really done the prep over the weekend, so you really need to pay attention. This is pretty much my go-to Monday outfit. Always, I'm always going for comfort whenever it comes to like my outfits, for any event, lectures, anatomy, clinical skills, I kind of want to be comfy. So I'm wearing these flared leggings, um, and then I'm just wearing this hoodie from Nasty Gal. It's super, super long, which I like. To be honest, if I had like an in-person lecture, I'd probably wear a similar thing. Like, I think during first year, I wore very similar things to this anyway. Um, so yeah, I think online and in-person lectures, you should try and get up and get dressed anyway. Like, if it's online, I've done it in my pajamas before, but it's probably better not to so that you're like fully paying attention. And um, so yeah, I'd probably wear this in person and online. But it's very common for us to have like a day off during the week. And I don't know why that is like, well, I'm, I'm not complaining, but like, yeah, we'll typically have like one or two days off. Like we only have lectures and stuff like, maybe three to four days. So on my day off, I'd just be wearing like leggings, something really, really comfy. I wouldn't be going anywhere. So I'd just wear like some socks um, and yeah, leggings and a t-shirt pretty much. Probably catching up on lectures, making notes, studying. My top is actually from Misguided. It came as part of this set. So um, I don't wear the trousers that often because the trousers are a bit see-through. Um, I tend to wear them with leggings or like jogging bottoms. And then these leggings are from Savage X Fenty. When it comes to uni and like clothing, I feel like there are some essentials that it's ideal to have. Like leggings are essential in my opinion, like a good cozy pair of jogging bottoms that you can wear at home, but you can also like wear outside. And then lots of t-shirts, different sizes, different fits, like some fitted ones, but some baggy ones, definitely jumpers and hoodies. Like bring your levers hoodies, bring your like skiing hoodies. It'd be like a good warm winter jacket because in the winter, especially up north, it does get really, really cold. Maybe a good scarf as well. If you're a medical student or if you maybe you'll have placement or a job or job interviews, maybe some like smart clothing as well. Uh, so yeah, those are my essentials. So I usually have I'd say like three to four seminars each week. Sometimes you've got them back to back. Seminars are kind of like small groups that like you usually have, um, you're usually in like a smaller group of like 10 to 15. Sometimes you'll have a table so that you can do like group work together. It's similar to a lecture, like you just want to be comfy. So for my typical lecture days, I would probably just wear like a hoodie or um, like a t-shirt or something just comfy really. I just get my bag, put on my trainers and then go. So on a Thursday, if I had anatomy, I always wear like a baggy t-shirt and again, leggings again. Um, I'd always wear comfy trainers as well, like my Vans or like some Air Forces. With anatomy, no one sees your top anyway because you wear like a massive lab coat on top. So I just wear something comfy, but it's always so hot in the anatomy, like dissection room, that I wouldn't wear a jumper or anything like too tight. I'd wear a loose fitting t-shirt, something like this that's breathable. With anatomy, I'd probably wear like a similar combo to go out as like my clinical skills. So I'd always wear a scarf just because I get cold so easily and then again my black puffer jacket I wore this a lot in um, second year this was probably my most worn jacket to be honest my go-to bag was always my Neutrogena bag I'm pretty sure I got this for free out of a gift set or something um, but it's just really really lightweight I love tote bags because they're just so convenient and you can like they go with everything they go with they go with literally everything on Friday if I was to have clinical skills this would always be what I wear like for every single day of placement this year. This was my outfit. It was pretty much just a plain white ribbed t-shirt. And then I always wear these black um, new look trousers. They're from the tall section, so they are quite long. Um, and then I always wear my smart shoes with them. For placement, you always have to have your hair like tied back or in a bun or something, um, or in like a ponytail. So I always do that or I'd have it in like a clip. I find that this is always just the comfiest outfit to wear because you don't want to be like uncomfortable in the dress and tights are falling down and stuff. 
you're also not allowed um, anything below like your elbow. So you, your sleeves have to be like short sleeve or like stop there. They can't be like long ones um, or you can roll them up. You also don't want to have any rings on, any bracelets, any nail polish. Like it literally has to be like bare below the elbow. That's the term they always use, bare below the elbow. Um, but next year we're actually wearing scrubs. That's really exciting. Um, so yeah, I think next year it will be I won't even have to worry about what to wear to placement, which is great. I'll just have to like throw on scrubs and then I can just go. So on your placements or on your clinical skills, you'll also bring your stethoscope if you if you need it that day. Sometimes we don't actually need them um, and we tend to just like pop them there and be like, hi, I'm a medical student. <laughs> you always feel like a little bit of an idiot because you're like, you, you literally don't know what you're doing, but you look like you do. So if I was literally like going to the med school or like going to placement, I'd probably wear um, literally this exact outfit. And then I tend to wear my handgun backpack. I've actually made a what's in my bag video with this bag. Um, so yeah, that's like my placement outfit. So on a Saturday, if I was going out with my friends, flatmates, or if I was just going out, I'd probably wear something like this. I started doing that trend where you do like a piece of string on your jeans. I'm not sure if I like it though. I feel like, yeah, it kind of looks better with that. Anyway, um, yeah, I would wear, especially in the summer, I always try and wear white tops, so like a lighter colored top, so that I don't like overheat or anything. I'd also try and do my hair as well. I did do my hair at the start of the video, but then it like gradually just, gone my hair would be like nice and curly or straightened or something and i'd try and wear some jewelry so i've got like my little capricorn necklace and then um some bracelets and stuff and then earrings i'd try and wear some hoops sometimes if i'm going out for like a meal with friends i definitely would still carry my neutrogena this is my everyday bag i would still carry it i feel like it goes with what i'm wearing but if i was making more of an effort like if i was going on like a date or something i'd maybe carry this one i rarely ever use this bag uh, but yeah if i was like making effort to go somewhere it's probably be what i wear and yeah with my air forces um so on a sunday this would be my go-to outfit literally just pajamas like anything comfy and cozy probably on a sunday if i was at uni i'd probably just be catching up on work this is um like a really old top from Topshop. it's very small fitting like this is a size 14. sorry what these trousers are from new look they're from the tall section so they're really really long and i would normally just wear them with like fuzzy socks and yeah i'd just be chilling on a sunday Thank you guys so much for watching. All the outfit info and details will be uh, mentioned down below. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for watching. Bye. Just wear them for like two hours. Can some? And then. Uh... But next year we actually are wearing scrubs. Okay. Um, but next year we're actually wearing scrubs. That's really exciting. Following through Monday to Sunday. Hi guys. So fit of a